It's game time! Hey, Maddie! Ready to figure out today's shape of a jigs? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, Zeke. I always love watching those tricky shape of a jigs. Let's do it! What's it going to be today? It's a mouse! The shape of a jigs have to make another mouse! Show us your tricks, shape of a jigs! They have to use a half circle, two full circles, a rectangle, and don't forget the tiny black circles. You think they can do it? Of course they can! The shape of a jigs can make anything! I saw a mouse just yesterday in my garden. It was the size of an elephant. <laughs> an elephant? But elephants are big and huge. And mice are teeny tiny. I meant that the mouse was as big as my elephant stuffed animal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that makes much more sense. I saw a mouse too once. It came out of a hole in the wall at my house to look for cheese. Cheese is a mouse's favorite food. I know. The mouse in our house would make itself grilled cheese sandwiches. Mice don't eat sandwiches. They eat plain cheese. They just nibble, nibble, nibble until it's all gone. Zeke, did you know that some people keep mice as pets? They're kind of like hamsters, but have bigger ears. So that they can hear when a cat is coming. Cats like playing with mice. But I'm not so sure that mice like playing with cats. <laughs> I think they'd rather play with shape of a jigs Speaking of the shape of a jigs look, Zeke, they made a mouse using all those shapes. The half circle made the body. The full circles made the ears. The rectangle made the tail. And the tiny circles made the nose and eyes. Nice work, Shape of Jigs. You did it again. You can make anything. We get our kicks. We know their tricks. We love playing with shape of my jigs. <laughs> <laughs>